Hey everybody, it's Karn here. Uh, today I've got a player review for Wilfred and Didi for his Team of the Season so far card. Um, so pretty much same thing as we did last time for the Brandt review. We're just going to have some gameplay and then we're just going to have a little final thoughts segment. Um, so let's just jump into a game here. It's going to be a game of the Weekend League, uh, like all my reviews so far. Or I've only done one so far. Um, I've only used them in the weekend league because I feel like that's the toughest competition. You really get to, you really get the best feel of a player in there, uh, compared to like something like squad battles, which is pretty fairly easy. So yeah, we're just gonna hop into a game here. Field that Bobby is scary. That Conte is great. Son's great. That Bergwijn is great. All right. Welcome on what is an ideal night for football. Right, You've got if. We always Andy, know there's going to be lots at stake. It's going to be exciting as well. Will we get a great game? An inability to Maldini. keep hold of the ball Fucking there. You, lad. Rashford has got oh, the no right way, idea with that pass. And a goal right up. Great tackle, Ndidi. Great pass. Tevez. Let's go, counter. Mateusz Pereira. Uh, well, he's lost the ball. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. So, it's there for him. Powerful enough. That's, but not, that's not the right enough. decision. No, not accurate right enough at all. That is a other terrible shot well. selection. He could have done a lot better there. I know must going to see a long pass here. Great ball. He's got space. Okay. Teammates could potentially join in. Fernandinho, oh, it might be on for them. On to Ronaldo. Still looking for space. Great and finish right there. Great play. He was, he's been amazing so far. Great pass in DD. Racing forward, trying to catch them Great out. Great ball in DD. They need to get bodies back. And let's go off that it's play a from a great ball from DD. Let's go. And they've only gone on a plan. Marital situation. Great job, indeed. Like that, interceptions have been amazing. Conte. Another great fucking tackle. Indeedy. Oh, look at that shit. Beauty. Uh, with it. With it. With it. Right. Indeedy. Good pass, indeed. Ronaldo. Neymar. A bit sloppy in possession. Uh, can I just can they on? trouble the opposition this time? And he's taken it away. Okay. Oh, I should have played that down wide. Fuck. Back to one. Same thing down wide. Oh, Great This is Neymar. Now, Ndidi. Great passing. Ronaldo. Put him again. Ndidi. Nice. Now oh, great Neymar. ball, Ndidi. Maneuvering his way forward. Fine uh, goalkeeping. Good goalkeeping right from him, wasn't it? Neymar. Yeah, nice and simple. He'll get it again. Now let's see. Um, let's get right into the second one here. The throw to the opposition. That's bad. Not much time to make up his mind. Yes, Troy. Unable um, to keep the ball that time. Too. It's a that right wing back. Pass. Mentality coming out. Let's go. Oh, nice. Son. Oh, yes, Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Nice. Giving yes, the ball indeed. to the opposition. His positioning has been amazing. Him and uh, Fernando. Oh, what a ball, now, ball name are. Oh, fuck, terrible. He tried passing. doing way too much there. Oh, great. Jeez, what a ball. Let's go. Well, is, oh, Sorry, you gotta score this. Oh, oh, oh great ball again. Taco. Now, indeed, he. Yeah, look at that. You're, I can count on him never to lose the ball. I can count. Great tackle, indeed. Like, stuff like that. He's. Indeed, he. On the usual theme, short, an attack full of promise, an important oh, interception. Oh, oh. and He's indeed he gets score. the goal, and that's the that's keep. a wrap. Looks like that looks like it's a wrap. Is he making subs? That's a wrap. Great game, four one. Um, he got he got he got an early goal, but it turns out doesn't it didn't really matter. Nine point four for NDD, not bad. DD had a pretty solid game. Got himself a goal. Uh, uh, he got, he didn't get an assist. I'm sure if I take a look at his, yeah, shots one for one, passes 22 for 22. Like, he attempted 20, the most passes in the game. 
He attempted the most passes in the game and he completed the most passes in the game. Like that, it dribbles 20 for 20 as well. Like, perfect. Like I said, as I was, as I was playing there, perfect. He's literally been perfect crosses. I don't even cross. I know, let's see tackles here. Three for three for tackles. Literally a perfect game. How is he not getting a 10.0 rating for a CDM? Uh, that, that should be a 10.0 rating right there for sure. Not what I needed him for, but. Uh, so as an overall rating, I'm going to be giving him a 9.5. Um, I think he did his job as a CDM. Uh, before I break into why exactly I got a 9.5, I'm just going to go into some of his other stats. So in 30 games, he got himself a goal and five assists. Not not what I have him for. I don't have him for scoring goals. I don't really have him for scoring, uh, getting assists either. I have him for starting the play. So pretty much I have him for winning the ball back, starting the play, getting it up, getting it forward. That's what I needed from him. That's what he did. Every time, perfectly. Um, pass accuracy, 95% of his passes hit the dot. Uh, that's amazing. Like he's not messing up his passes. That's brilliant. Shot accuracy, 100%. That, that's a little... Um, a little not accurate because uh, he doesn't shoot much. So when he does shoot, it's probably going to be on net. It's probably going to be a wide open chance to hit the net. So shot accuracy doesn't really matter in my opinion. And it's a bit um, exaggerated. Dribble actually 98%. He does dribble a lot. Um, as you can see, he completed about 14.5 dribbles a game. And completing about 98% of his dribbles. So he's going like over 14 out of 15 dribbles. So he's barely messing up a dribble a game barely like he was of course i'm not doing things like going through players with him but i'm i'm getting the ball back and i'm starting the play off with him a lot and then tackle actually 60 percent. i am diving in a lot with him that is why um a lot of the time uh his the times he wins the ball back for me is mostly interceptions it's not even tackles so he doesn't have that many tackles per game only 1.5 uh but this is over a lot of games uh like the gameplay we watched he had three um, but he, he, when he gets stuck in, he wins the ball back. So looking at all of those stats and looking at how I felt for him, I did give him a 9.5. Uh, I broke that into a few things. So first of all, his pace, I gave him an 8.1. Are there faster players out there? Obviously. But for a CDM, he was quick enough. Um, uh, shooting 7.5, I didn't shoot with him much. He scored one goal. The goal he did score was a nice finish, um, but I didn't shoot much. I'm sure... If you shoot more with him, maybe I could give him a bit higher of a rating, but 7.5, just looking at his stats, he's got 81 shooting. He's got good enough stats for a, for a shooting card. Um, passing, I'm giving him a 9.5, one of his highest ratings. Um, his passing was amazing for a CDM. It's completely amazing. He'll, he'll win the ball back, and then he'll go forward, and he'll find the right, the right pockets of space to play the ball into. Um, all of his through passes were almost spot on, perfectly weighted. Um, his one twos, he was able to do quick one twos with Neymar, quick one twos with Pereira. Like it was, he was able to move the ball amazingly. Uh, dribbling, I'm gonna give him an 8.7 because obviously he did have amazing uh, dribbling completion, but of course I didn't try doing like uh, skill moves with him and I didn't try taking players on. I didn't try going uh, through a bunch of people like, Therefore, I can't give him above nine for sure because he doesn't have that capabilities. But um, I'm still going to give him 8.7 because of his dribbling in terms of a CDM. If you look at it in a CDM role, not in any other position, a CDM role, the dribbling that he does is perfect. Defending, he was he was always in the right spot, I found. He was intercepting plays all the time. Uh, he was a great physical presence. Uh, well, that's physical, but um, he was winning the ball back a lot for me. He was getting stuck into tackles. Uh, when he did get stuck in, he usually did come away with the ball or he knocked it loose for another player to come through and grab it. Um, Defending-wise, obviously 92 defending. He's a CDM. I don't need to go further into that. Uh, physical, he's tall. He's really tall. I think he's like 6'2". Um, and he's got uh, not, the, not the leanest of body builds. He's kind of skinny. But just because he's so tall, he's got a big presence in the game. So when he does get stuck in, he's really good physically as well. He gets the ball back. And his physical presence to shield players off the ball, uh, to hold the ball away from people, to get passes through was amazing as well. Uh, so all in all, I give him a 9.5 in terms of CDM. I think he is one of the best CDMs in the game, uh, especially for his price. Um, obviously, not the best of the best, but uh, in terms of, I'd say, Premier League CDMs, if you're looking for a good Premier League CDM and you haven't done this card, you should really do this card. 
for 184K, his value, I did give him a 9 out of 10. I could have given him a higher value. I think I probably should have given him a higher value, but 9 out of 10 is still pretty high. Um, that's a great price. That's a great SBC. And if you, if you haven't done it yet, you should definitely do his SBC. Uh, and then Cam Styles, I, was, I have a shadow or anchor on him. I, I had an anchor on him, sorry, but you could go with shadow if you want his pace even more off. You don't need a shooting to go up. You don't need his passing to go up. Honestly, his passing is already great. Uh, you could put his dribbling up, but uh, there's nothing that puts pace, dribbling, and defending or physical up. So I really wanted his pace and his defending. Uh, and then similar players, I would have Petit and Rykard. I'd say he's closer to Rykard than he is Petit, but I would say he's a better he's a better um, dribbler than Rykard. He's a better dribbler than Petit as well, for sure. Uh, I'd say he's a better passer than both of them as well. Um, and then he's obviously uh, just as fast as Rykard uh, in terms of what pace says, and he's faster than Petit. Uh, so yeah. Very similar card to Petit and Rykard. Um, in my opinion, honestly, he's better than Rykard. Uh, I'd even say he's up there with Petit. Um, really similar. Petit, obviously, is an icon. Can get better links. Blah, blah, blah. But um, in my opinion, I enjoyed Indeedy more than I have when I used Petit. But that's, uh, thanks for watching. Um, that's the end of this review. Hopefully, I have some more to come out this week. Um, and I do have my rewards. They're going to be out again this uh, Thursday. I hit a lead again. Um, hopefully I'm looking to get a couple more gen than just my rewards. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching and, uh, have a nice day and also please leave a like and maybe even subscribe if you feel like it. Thank you.